Okay, let's not waste any time. Have you ever had a scene where there's drastically different uh, scales and it's kind of hard? You, you do, you start navigating around and you, you zoom in and out and the viewport kind of gets stuck and you get kind of frustrated. Um, a really great way to do that, um, to fix that, is if you select the object that you want to zoom into, hit the tilde or back tick key. It's the key next to the one. So click on that and then click on view selected. That will just zoom you right into the object that you have selected. And then um, you can zoom in and out and it works as you norm as it normally would. Um, so it's just really useful. So um, any object in your scene, you know, just click on it, click that tilde key or back tick, and then click view selected and it will jump over there. You also can click um, directly on an object in the outliner over here and then back tick and click view selected and then we're jumping over here. So that's pretty great and useful um, but maybe even better um, if you're going between placing objects in your scene and actually modeling or making edits um, you can click on the object and then do the forward slash key which is next which is next to the shift key on the right side of your keyboard click that that will zoom to selected and it will hide everything else. So if I still need to make some edits on this, I really easily could tab in the edit mode, um, you know, select this ring, you know, do whatever I need to do. But um, just that forward slash will jump you in between, view that selected item, zoom into it, and hide everything else. And if you hit it again, it will go back to your normal scene. So just really useful and makes navigating the viewport just a lot easier.